It's been a while since I've shown my cabin in a vlog, but this contract I've made significant effort to upgrade it and make it a little bit more cozy. Before I left for my second contract, my mom bought me this book. It's The Little Book of Huga. It is Danish, and this does not look like Huga in English, but that's how you spell it in uh, Danish. This book is significant because our cruise ship is based out of Copenhagen and so my mom was very sweet and made this purchase because she knew that I was going to be in Copenhagen every nine days. Huga is a term that isn't directly translatable to English. It basically means Danish feng shui. In the book one of the examples they give of Huga is sitting in a log cabin while it's raining at sunset, drinking mulled wine with a fire going in a sweater with a cat sleeping in the corner. Here are a couple things that I've bought to make my cabin a little bit more Huga. The first thing I bought to make my cabin more Huga is a Himalayan salt lamp. Apparently the light bulb inside the lamp is supposed to heat up the salt crystals and release positive ions that clean the air. That is what the gurus and the people say, but I don't know if it's true. It has the same temperature as a candle, which is wonderful because we're not allowed to have candles on board. We can't have open flames, uh, but we can have lamps and because the temperature is very similar to a candle, it kind of has that soft, moody feel at night. I love it. Game's good. <clears throat> the second thing that I bought is a little fake plant. We're not allowed to have plants in our cabin, so I bought that fake plant just to have a little green. It's not a very big plant, but a little bit of green goes a long way to make a cabin feel more homey and more comfortable. Yes, see ya! The third thing I bought was this little uh, throw cover. It feels very Game of Thrones. You know nothing, Jon Snow. Honestly, this bed is so boring. Just white, 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 white. That it just, it adds a little texture and it's soft. It's like a microfiber kind of thing. This painting here, I did not buy. I took it from someone else's cabin who got fired. And it was just sitting in our boss's office with nowhere to go. So I put it in my cabin because it's big and it provides a splash of color where there exists otherwise very little. And the final thing that I've added to my cabin to make it more comfortable or huga is right up there. These mirrors were on my walls last contract, but I put them on the ceiling because what is the point of wall mirrors when you can have ceiling mirrors? They make sleeping a lot more fun and it provides a little uh, icing on the cake in terms of uh, design details. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye, 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 bye.